So open science is a new concept that involves opening up all your data, making it accessible to researchers around the world, firms, universities, other institutes, so that we can accelerate research. Open science is a way for us to get uh, faster access to knowledge from data. It's all very well having data. What you want is knowledge and ultimately wisdom. The way you do that is making the data available to more people. Open science in, in the field of neuroscience uh, we think is a game changer because it will allow acceleration of discovery and if the problem is that the, the brain is complex and, and discovery is, is, is slow because of that, by sharing we'll be able to go faster. We have zero treatments, none, that slow the course of any of these diseases, whether they be the dementias or Parkinson's or amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, we have nothing. Realistically, if we could come up with one really impactful treatment of a major brain disorder, this would be a dream come true. So what's particularly unique at the neuro is that not only are we publicizing data, not only are we making samples accessible, but the neuro has promised not to get patents for a period of five years so as not to slow down research. We don't collect any patient identifiers no names, no medical record numbers. It's collected in a coded way and stored in an encrypted database. And that encryption uses the same standards as your personal banking system. Open science allows the exploration of vast amounts of data by many people to generate new questions. And new questions generate new answers. This will, we think this was going to accelerate discovery, and accelerating discovery will mean finding things that will help people in a concrete way more quickly.